it's Megan. So today I was looking on my YouTube and it said it was my channel's birthday. So I've actually been on YouTube now for 16 years. That's actually a long time. My most popular video is from 2011. I think it's called Antimatter Spacecraft Propulsion The Future Is Now. It was basically like me putting a bunch of clips and images and stuff like that and research together about like antimatter propulsion and it has like 240,000 views or something like that. And like recently, like last year, December, I released the sustainability documentary called Antimatter Future. So it's basically like the next step like from all that research I did before. Well, I'm actually wearing something that's other than black for once. <laughs> I'm getting used to like wearing like almost always all black. I just kind of like like it. I don't know more like the goth look and everything. But like some days I'll wear like pink like that. I'm wearing black yoga pants though. <laughs> I'm like always wearing black. <laughs> so yeah, when I grew up like with YouTube and everything, like when I went to school, there was no information I was like taught about like LGBT plus and all that, like transgender, I had no idea. Like I struggled with gender dysphoria in high school with no freaking idea why I was feeling that way. And like I just suppressed my own feelings and happiness and stuff like that. I mean, I kind of wish like YouTube's algorithm would at least show me some of the content, trans content years and years before it started showing in my algorithm. So almost two years ago, I started hormone replacement therapy and came out as transgender. And like that was after like years and years and years of living in denial. So like I used to be so unhappy and just like generally just depressed with my life, hated my body. So this is my good camera that I used to use for my YouTube videos, except it's like these buttons are not like I can't use the to go left right and through the menus and stuff like that so I could I have to like I'm lucky I have the settings on um, that I want for like taking my daily photos I take my daily photos with these I don't use this camera for video anymore just because like I almost literally can't like the microphone on this is garbage quality you can hear the motor of the there's a, there's a motor in the, the long zoom on this. So it's like, yeah, <laughs> it actually comes out like, like that, but like there's a motor in there and you can hear the audio. So it, it's like, I can't use this for video. And I used to have a good microphone I would plug into here, except like the microphone stopped working. I got it in 2016 along with this camera. So I could like make the documentary overpriced in the documentary Antimatter Future. So like literally like moments after I finished narrating Antimatter Future and I was like 99% done. I did, I, I had like other stuff I wanted to like re-record but the microphone stopped working so I had to like work with what I had and it's unfortunate but I don't have the money for like another $500 microphone. <laughs> Like, that cost me a lot of money, and, like, I did, like, have it on here, like, years ago. Like, the microphone attached to here, and, like, I just, like, have the, the phone, my, my, my camera in my backpack, and, like, going everywhere filming, and, like, out in the rain, and, like, yeah, I'm, like, amazed this camera still works.